2019 Husky TX300. This is second ride on the Hoosier tires on the TX300. It's a little nicer day. It's actually dry enough. I can get in the woods. I got a nice loop set up. Uh, I'm still feeling the same way. I probably got about three hours, three and a half hours on the tires now. And man, they've got such great traction. Uh, soft uh, intermediate, they seem to cover that pretty well. Uh, the comfort level is super noticeable on these tires. They just absorb the little chop and they're very comfortable going over little sharp edge stuff. Uh, can't really say much about durability. Like I said, only got about three hours on the tracks. So you're still looking really good. They have this compliance feel to them. I'm still running about 14 PSI because I got the stock thin tubes in the, in the tires now. Uh, as I mentioned before, this bike has Olins on it. Those are FGKT 1986. That's the off-road fork. It's actually a little shorter than the air fork, so I've got them pushed down and I sagged out the back a little bit to kind of keep everything leveled out. TTX rear shock, Olin's valve for this 300. More of an off-road GNCC style comfort setting. I also am running the PWK 38 millimeter Kahin with the uh, Moto Tessinari V-Force 4 Reed. That just runs so good. I don't use the JD Jetting, I use the RM250 needle. Any, any CH in the middle position, third position, I think, 170 main, there's 38 pilot and air screw about one, one and a half. And it, it just covers a broad range and runs really well. I'm anxious to get on a TPI bike. I've putted around on some 18s and 19s and even got a chance to put just a little bit on a 20 TE and they're so improved. And uh, I think it'll be a nice, it'll be a nice option if you don't want to mess with mixing and and jetting and stuff like that so but today i got a i got a nice loop we'll start out do a little partial of the partial loop of the uh gp course then go in the woods and boy it's all green it's like a green tunnel in there with all the uh all the rain we've had lately things are grown up and i've got a couple go arounds for some down trees and little soft spots so anyhow we'll go take a quick lap as i said before the kinking it just runs really good it covers a broad range. And I know TPI, here in Ohio, we don't change elevation a lot. I ride in the winter, but uh, this setting seems to work pretty broad. It's got that nice quick, quick response. Very easy to control. Mm-hmm. 